I just finished blowing it up. I don't know why, but I couldn't put any more air in there, like physically. Couldn't get it in there, but it's really not blown up well. It's really meant for like little infants, not for toddlers. <laughs> Sydney's so excited. So whatever, we're gonna make it work for today. She's probably just gonna like walk around for the most part, but she's pretty much bottoming out. Are you bottoming out? Almost. If you finish the rest of your yogurt and get dressed, then we can go outside and play, okay? So you gotta finish your yogurt, okay, babe? Um, You guys, Sydney and I slept in today. I slept in until 9 a.m. Sydney slept until 9.20. We both must be going through a gross spurt. No idea. But anyway, it felt amazing. I set my alarm for seven because I am going to start waking up before her. I said I was going to do that like this fall, but I'm really going to start waking up before her. I'm probably going to wake up around like 6.30, 7 o'clock every morning. Now that I'm going to put my makeup stuff upstairs in my bedroom and um, I'm, you know, I'm just going to start waking up before her because um, I need to start acting like a businesswoman instead of stay at home mom status you know what i mean like i need to as far as youtube goes um so yeah but i set my alarm for seven and totally sure i turned it off instead of hit snooze like i thought i like i thought i did i'm pretty sure i probably meant to shut it off but anyway i slept till nine and it kind of felt amazing so i'm super excited my goal today is to get christmas stuff taken down um at least everything off the tree and you know every other little thing I'll put away and then we'll see about the tree decorations but um that is my goal for today and it snowed just like two or three inches so i'm really excited to get her outside she's really excited to get outside ready to go babe ready to get dressed okay okay I'm just gonna shut the door. Yeah. Yeah. Is it hard? <laughs> it's hard to walk. Wow. Oh, you are so precious. Sydney, are you excited? She crawled the whole way here. Uh. Just huggies. 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 Tracks. Wow. Tracks. Tracks? Just hug. Tracks. We're gonna go pull her in her sled. Ready? Hold on. Someone did not want to come inside, but now we're having a snack, a little, um, what are you, cuties, the little tangerines? Tangerine? Tangerine, orange. Do it good. Mm. They're like her favorite snack currently. Are they so good? 
I wish I had gotten it. I was pulling her so fast, like sprinting, and she was dying laughing. She didn't want to like just be casually pulled. She wanted to go on an adventure ride. Um, I couldn't, I didn't get it on camera because I had brought this inside, but it was so much fun. I'm out of breath now. <laughs> I feel like I ran a marathon. <laughs> Again. <laughs> Mentioned or even showed you guys, but my someone, bike, my bike. someone, no, not right now, honey. Someone got their bike put together, and I'm super pumped for it. I think the the gray guards right here need to come off because she's ready to put her feet on the pedals. I think. Yeah, I'm really happy that I returned the rug, and I think I'm gonna. What I'm gonna do is I'm either going to find a rug first and decorate around the rug or I'm going to decorate everything else and then find a neutral rug later. I don't really know what to do because I got these first and maybe I shouldn't have, I don't know, but those are more like peachy coral and I don't know if the blush pink, that tone, you know, goes with it. Um, but I'm gonna be moving this ASAP up to my bedroom. And then I still have Sydney's um, teepee tent that I'm going to be putting in this playroom, but that has more of like the normal pink tones, mint and purple. So we'll see. Um, I'm really, really, really excited to get this room going. And I'm going to paint the walls. Currently they're like a forest green color and I want to paint it a neutral like white cream color, just neutral because I don't have any neutral walls. I mean, I have neutral, but... It's more of like a gray throughout my entire house, but I want this room to be white slash cream walls. And uh, going to get the wicker baskets to go on top of there. Um, good job, Sydney. She's like so pumped about everything now. I love this age. She's growing up. She's able to do bikes and play. And oh gosh. I love it. You want to ride the bike in the house? All right, Mama will let you. kitchen there for now until we get the playroom all settled. I guess that's where it's gonna go. You wanna cut the tomatoes? Uh. Everyone wanna know what mom life is like? Mommy's cooking dinner. I'm doing pasta with big chicken, Italian style. You know, yummy, right? I turn around. Kiss. You need a kiss. Did you get a boo-boo? Okay, I'll kiss it, mama will kiss it. Give, give me your stinky toes to kiss. Is it better? Yeah. Better, okay. Yeah. So this is the party that's happening behind me. You're happy and you're safe. I guess that's all that matters. <laughs> oh my gracious me. 
Okay, and then I have been using Rayo's, or however you pronounce it, pasta sauce lately. I've tried the garlic one, which is super, super garlicky, and then I'm trying this one. Um, and you guys recommended it to me, said it was the best jarred, like, taste homemade, and it's really, really good. It's definitely really expensive for jarred pasta sauce, but it's so good. Um, so we're gonna have, like, Italian, um, pasta with cheese, and then that tomato sauce. I can get it. Yeah, you want pasta? Mama's got... Uh, it's cooking right now, honey, okay? And then I'm making peas, and I did um, just some baked chicken. I did Italian seasoning, salt and pepper, olive oil, and garlic, and just baked that, and then I'll kind of toss it all together to make a nice, yummy dinner. Oh, and leftover biscuits I made the other day. Yum. You hungry? She's so hungry. So hungry. Okay. She pretty much handles her vacuum the way that I handle mine. <laughs> Good job, Sydney. You're vacuuming for mommy? Thank you. Um, 